The Words of This Life with Apostle Grace Lubega. Some people do not know how to stand before greatness. Esther, the story of a king, success, the god of the virgins, and then started preparing them for about a year, and then each virgin comes before the king. And when they came before the king of greatness, they spoke whatever they spoke and left. The Bible says when it was Esther's turn to go to the king, she asked for nothing other than what Haggai, the king's eunuch in charge of the harem, had recommended. Esther, the Bible says, just as she was, won the admiration of everyone who saw her. She gained favor before everyone. Why? When these women were prepared, they thought that their beauty would smite the king. So they go to greatness with beauty. This girl Esther goes to Haggai and asks him, how am I supposed to? answer and what am I supposed to ask for? The Bible says distinctively she only answered the way Haggai had told her to answer. Meaning she consulted with the man who knows the king better to know how the king wants to be answered. Instead of assuming that her beauty would give her a ticket and then create a demand because of her beauty. That's Jezebel. That's manipulation. She was not seeking to seduce greatness. She knew that sitting in the office of a queen was more than just beauty. There was something that was needed because her responsibility to the children of Israel was more than just being a queen. She is the salvation of Israel. She was raised for such a time. Her assignment was bigger than what was being seen. It was satisfaction to Haggai that this king had found the right woman after the fall of Vashti. But it was also important to Esther to understand that when she stands before greatness, she must yield to instructions bigger than her personal desire and dream. Every time you elevate it to greatness, you start to understand that it's not about you. And the more God elevates you, the more you start to see the self die. But if you keep the self in the elevation, you frustrate the spirit of greatness. Join our online family, spread the love, and follow us on our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Finero, make manners.